Hi everybody. Um, this is a tutorial for covering the update for iOS 9.0 uh, regarding the problematic web view access of uh, encrypted uh, website and all, whatever it is, this uh, new update from iOS 9 that stop people from uh, getting access to web content that is not encrypted and um, using the old release, you, you used to do that with web view, but currently there's a lot of restriction on it. The recommended solution is to use the new update from iOS 9 that is using the uh, new web kit from uh, Apple. That is the, the name of that kit is called the uh, Safari Web View Control. The, this has offer this offering has more advantage and definitely one of the recommended way that I think everybody should be using replacing WebView. You have any uh, application that happen to have a uh, WebView uh, access. Um, the first thing you need to do for accessing your web content from an application using um, Safari Web View Control is to add that framework. First is to add that framework. The framework, the name is called, I believe, is Safari Service. Let me just go and grab that. There you go. This is Safari Service uh, framework from Apple. And once you add that, go to the view controller, wherever your old web view controller is, and add that header file, update it. <coughs> First, import the uh, web kit, the, sorry, the uh, Safari Web View Control. I believe the name is uh, Safari. Let me just go to the framework and add that in. There you go. It's called Safari Service. Safari Service. Safari Service. So stop. Page. There you go. Now you're gonna add the delegate for that Safari delegate. Let me just go to that. This one. Oh, there you go. Actually, give you some uh, SF. There you go. After that, once the SF Safari view control delegate is added, go to your main uh, view control where you will insert your used to insert your web view. That in case my in my case is with my mail view controller. I already have the, some uh, practice uh, by reading the uh, text from Apple. Uh, first thing you need to do is to uh, find wherever your view did load uh, pro, uh, initialization of your web view, uh, of your view is, and uh, locate that uh, that section. And uh, underneath the view did load, uh, you're gonna start doing your web view at decoration. First, you need to do the uh, find the view control and uh, declare a pointer for that. And in case this is uh, SF Safari control, that okay your memory for that. Initialize it with your URL and uh, give it the NSURL text. And URL screen string is the website actually. So in my case, I be typing my own website. HTTP profilemyrun.com. This is and it can be anything. It can be your own uh, site. And in my case, it's profilemyrun.com. And uh, you don't want to do your after that, uh, I'm missing out on something here. Oh, I forgot about the double the quotation. Yeah, here, here we go. And then you can do. Uh, it's always a good thing to know why suddenly all this uh, available stuff is not available anymore. The automated. Type auto complete is not. Sometimes you have auto complete that is not happening, and you can find your own error on the fly. This is so awesome. 
But anyway, after this is declared, you have a pointer SVC calling to uh, controller and is ready to go. So, it's, uh, but, but you have to activate it first. So, the, activate the delegate by doing the SVC dot delegate and self. In this case, it's me, it's no self, and uh, just do initializing. After that, you do the self present present view controller with um, SVC and animation. No, we don't want to animate it too much. Uh, you want to app website to be animated. So also you don't want to complete. You want to have a link whatever you are doing to have a link on it. So uh, once you do that, and you are good to go. Let me just test it out real quickly. Let's go to uh.